Hey guys, what's up? It is Drew here from Lone Fox. I hope you're having an amazing day so far. I know I am, and it's gonna get even more amazing because today we are going to be doing an Amazon kind of collective favorites haul video for you guys, which I love doing these. I've only done like two or three on my channel in the past. As many of you know, I recently moved into a brand new apartment, and when doing so, I kind of got rid of some older things that I've had for years and years, and I've introduced a couple of newer items that I purchased from Amazon for just like a super quick turnaround while moving. And I asked you over on Instagram if you wanted to see kind of an updated Amazon favorites video and literally 6,700 people said yes and 200 people said no. So 97% of people said yes. I figured I'm going to do it for you guys. Everything featured is going to be linked in the description box below in case you are curious. I love sharing these pieces with you guys because they're just really great kind of affordable options that also are very utilitarian. They serve a purpose and they look pretty and they're cute and all of those sort of things. So they're going to be linked below. As many of you know, I run an online shop as well called LoneFox.com where I have super cute home decor, DIY supplies, um, merch and just a lot of stuff kind of relating to my channel basically and I let me grab it just launched my second ever DIY kit which I am so excited about DIY kits are something that I've wanted to do for so long and I recently started kind of creating them and I just created my second one and it's actually for this really cute mixed metal kind of boho wall decor piece now I did this DIY on my channel a while back and so many people requested kits for this one I was like I'm gonna go ahead and try to make some kits so that's exactly what I did and I created kits for this. So if you guys would like your own DIY kit to create this piece, they're available on my shop now. So I'll link that below. This is just going to be like a fun little chit chat. So let's start off with this, which you guys have seen me already talk about this on my channel and on my Instagram. If you follow me over there, this is the Rust-Oleum American Accents Terracotta Spray Paint. This stuff is incredible. As many of you guys probably already saw, I recently featured this in my dollar store DIY video where I took some simple dollar store kind of glass containers and I sprayed them with a terracotta spray paint to give them like a very surreal ceramic terracotta finish. They legit looked like they were like handcrafted and then like made of terracotta clay. I already stocked up on legit four cans of this because you guys were buying it out like crazy when I posted it. So if it's still available, I'm going to link it below, which I'm pretty sure it is, but it is a great one to have in your stash for sure. The next item is for the Lone Fox room. And as many of you guys know, I have an additional room in my apartment now, which I'm so grateful for. That is just honestly my craft studio Lone Fox sanctuary area. Like I can have whatever I want in here. I've been organizing my supplies in there and I got these baskets and I love them. So I wanted to share them with you guys. I actually got five of them. Um, the other three are in use at the moment, kind of organizing stuff, but these are what they look like. And I love how they have this very woven kind of raffia rattan vibe to them, but they have a structural metal, but they have a very structural metal but they have, but they have a nice structure to them because they're actually constructed of metal. So they're actually very, very strong and durable and you could store a ton of stuff in here as well. And I just like how they were shallow, but they still had a good depth to them and how they had this handle in the front. So I can easily pull it out of my shelving system that I installed in that room as well, which you're going to see very shortly. And I just really like them. So I wanted to share those with you. Next up, I have some pots and pans and these might not be of interest to everybody, but I needed new pots and pans for sure. I've used the same one since I moved to LA in 2013 and I still have the same ones, two pots and two pans. I got a new set recently and I just love these so much. They're copper. How cute are these? And the copper color is not too orange. It's the most perfect kind of like muted, unsaturated copper. They have that ceramic kind of nonstick coating because they're not actually made of copper. They just have a copper color to them. And the outside's hammered, which I think just adds so much interest and detail. I personally think that this three piece set here, keep in mind, they also come with lids. These are the three pieces. This cost $60. And I think for $60, this is an amazing deal because traditional copper cookware, which is actually made of copper, can like be thousands of dollars. So I got this set for $60 and it's really all I need. I guess since we're on the realm of kitchen, I'm going to share with you guys my new bread box. And I saw someone on TikTok have this bread box and I was like, oh my gosh, I need that. It was like those TikToks that are like five Amazon items you never knew you needed. And I was like, I actually didn't know I need that bread box, but I purchased it. So I thought I would share it with you, but I got this for the kitchen because my roommate and I actually consume a lot of bread, I guess you could say. Not very proud of it, but oh well. And I just think that this is so cute and simple. So I got that for the kitchen. Now this is a fun little product here. This is something that I saw highly reviewed on Amazon and I use stuff like this all the time. So I was like, I'm gonna purchase it and I am obsessed with it. This is called Sugru. Now, if you've never heard of this, it is moldable glue. And basically it is waterproof, heat and cold resistant. It holds up to five pounds. It's weatherproof, it's flexible. So inside of the package, you actually get these little smaller packages and there are some white ones and then there's 
black ones as well so you kind of can gauge what color you want to use and inside it basically feels like clay like if you know that poster tack stuff that you would put posters on the wall with that's what it feels like but it dries hard and it also dries extremely strong bond I find it really really nice and quick for like simple fixes like if you just like need to hang a hook on the wall or you want to refasten like a knob on a cabinet or something you can literally use this and you don't have to drill a hole or anything now wooden bead decor has become pretty popular as many of you guys know and I was always like I want a set of wooden beads but they're also like kind of expensive and I was like I'm gonna make my own but then when I actually added up the cost to make my own wooden bead set it was like a dollar savings as opposed to purchasing this one from Amazon so I decided to purchase this one from Amazon and it is literally a strand of wooden beads and you can literally just hang this inside of a bowl if you want to kind of hanging off the side you can put it over the top of books it's basically just a little decorative element to add a bit more interest to your space I see people use these on coffee tables you can put them in shelf decor whatever you want to do there's no rhyme or reason to this other than it kind of just sits on top of something and looks cute I'm gonna share with you guys my new wine glasses and I have never owned wine glasses proper ones I have like the little stemless ones which were great but I actually wanted some legit wine glasses um, and these are just so pretty I found them on Amazon they're kind of have a little bit of like cardboard dust on them but can you see how amazing these look they almost have this fluted detail on the outside and then they are just the most perfect little wine glass you get a set of four and look how nicely they can package in this cardboard material but I love the shape of this glass but I absolutely love kind of the vintage inspired glassware look this is just so cute and perfect I could see this at CB2 for like $20 for the one glass since we're on the topic of wine I figured I might as well also share with you guys that simple little wooden wine rack that I picked up for the horror movie room makeover which I'll insert a clip of it on the screen here but this wine rack was from Amazon I believe it was like under $20 and it holds 16 bottles of wine and literally it comes unconstructed you piece it together really quickly and I gave it a little bit of a stain as well to kind of make it look a little bit more elevated than just like the natural pine color and I love it it serves its purpose so well and a lot of you guys asked about it so I figured I would feature it here because I did purchase it for that space and I totally forgot to even mention it in the video now some decor that I picked up which I think these are so cool are these vases these are literally like arch vases and I have been loving arches so much in home decor like anything arch related or rounded I have been just fascinated towards or like asphyxiated towards what's the word fixated I think that could be it and there's like this white one here that has this really nice ridging on it it has a very mod kind of retro touch and it has the hole up here it almost looks like a little house and then you also get the black version which just has the arch to it and I love these so much I'm really excited to style these I purchased them actually for my bedroom on top of my dresser and I want to put some branches in here so these are the vases that I got but let me share with you some branches I also got now these branches are not going to go inside of these particular vases but I did purchase these for the living room area and I have been obsessed with olive branches something about olive branches have just been I don't know I just been really loving the look of them and I feel like a lot of designers have been using olive branches lately so this is a set of I believe five olive branches I found this on Amazon they are such nice quality they look 100% legit they have little olives on them so yeah I got five stems of these and I feel like they're very plentiful like you get quite a bit per stem and it really adds up um, this definitely will fill a full vase for sure and make it look nice and full so this next item is very random but it was definitely necessary because when I moved into my new apartment in our old one we had the luxury of having an ice machine in the fridge but our new one does not have one so we actually have to create our own ice which is no worries but I'm going to be doing so with this ice cube maker so these are little hexagon shaped ice cubes so you basically just put the water in here you put it in your freezer it freezes away and you have little hexagon cubes but the nice thing is that they actually come stackable so you can purchase multiple of these and you can actually stack them up they have like a little kind of separator in between you get two of them in a pack you can even put juice in these whatever you want to do and they're little hexagons uh, I just liked them I wanted to share them okay so when I shared with you those pots and pans I kind of mentioned how I wanted to start cooking a little bit more so I actually picked up two cookbooks to kind of aid in my cooking um, because I've never been one to cook I love the idea of cooking and baking but I just never really gotten into doing it and I hope that these books will kind of inspire me to do so so the first one I picked up is the Magnolia table I just absolutely love Joanna Gaines 
I think that she's incredible and is a very, very good businesswoman and just overall like aesthetically pleasing, like just overall vibe. You know, Magnolia is just such an incredible brand. So I picked up the Magnolia table. This is a volume two. And inside are just a collection of so many incredible looking recipes. Like the photos are beautiful in here. I'm really, really excited to recreate some of these items um, and to see how I can do my own take on them as well. But there's lots of different things from quiches, there's desserts, breakfasts, lunch options. Um, there's a lot of really, really great things in here. Here's huevos rancheros. But I have also picked up the Half Bake Harvest Cookbook and I just absolutely love Tegan's Instagram. If you do not follow her, her food is just to die for. Like I wanna eat all of it. And whenever she posts a recipe that I'm super interested in, she's like, this is one of the ones for my cookbook. And I'm like, wow, it would be the one that's not on your website. So I had to pick up her cookbook and I'm very happy I did. It has so many incredible reviews. It's literally a New York Times bestseller. So congrats to you, Tegan. This is a great cookbook, but here she is in there and she just has so many kind of more comfort food style recipes, which I love a good comfort food. And a lot of them are also very, very simple. It says more than 125 recipes for instant overnight meal prep and easy comfort food. So I picked up this cookbook as well. So we're kind of reaching the end, but I want to share this with you guys too. So I picked up a new set of knobs for my dresser because as many of you guys know, I actually purchased those like black longer knobs for my um, Ikea dresser in the other room. Now I love the way that these knobs look, but it they are frustrating you guys. Like they twist and turn and pivot in all points of direction at all times of day. Like they won't stay horizontal. I don't know what it is. I could probably glue them if I wanted to, but I figured I'm just going to pick up some new knobs for this dresser and I opted for these ones and they are incredible. I hope you can see these. They're a raw brass circle knob. They just have such an insane detail to them. I love this kind of little um, popped out front here. They also have this ridge back here, which I think just adds a little bit of detail and they're just very, very comfortable and heavy weight. And when I tell you guys I got these for such an incredible deal, you get 10 of them in this package and I believe they're under $30 for all 10. And these are quality. Like I, if you get these in person, you are gonna see how incredible these are, but I'm really excited. I actually got two boxes of them because I wanna use them on projects in the future. And the last item that I'm gonna share with you guys is kind of random, but it was something that I really needed and I thought I would share it. This is a duvet insert, so you can put this inside of any duvet cover. And I have been in dire need of one of these. Mine in here is probably like seven years old from when I used to work at West Elm. It was right when I moved here. And the duvet, like the actual like cushiony part, they're kind of like sewn into pockets and they're all pressed to the end of a pocket. So it's just time for a new duvet insert. And I got this one on Amazon and it is so fluffy, comfy, soft, but lightweight. Like it's not super, super heavy, which I need that because in Los Angeles, it is not super cold. It is not super hot at all times. I believe it's also like $30. It's very affordable and I'm just excited. I'm gonna be putting this in here and I think it's just gonna be a little bit easier to sleep with as opposed to this really thick one because a lot of times I'm throwing this off me in the middle of the night and it's just like no point. So I got this thinner one, but it's still quality, you know, like it's still thick. So I really like it. Alrighty guys, so those are my Amazon favorites for you guys. I hope this video wasn't too crazy and rambly and just like talking fast. I was just very excited about everything I featured in here and I hope that you guys enjoyed them as well. And then again, everything I did feature is going to be linked in the description box in case you are curious. And yeah, so if you are not already, make sure to subscribe to my channel for brand new videos every single week and click that little bell icon next to the subscribe button. That way you're notified every time I upload a brand new video. And leave that's about all. I will see you all in my next video. Have an amazing rest of your day and let me know in the comment section if you purchased anything. I would love to know. If you have any Amazon favorites you've been loving lately, please comment them below as well. We could have a conversation down there about Amazon favorites. So I'll catch you guys all in my next one. Have an amazing rest of your day and I'll see you next time. Bye guys.